Christian, two wins in two weeks, mate. Uh, where's this form come from? I don't know, to be honest, mate. Uh, so surprising, and I've uh, just strung together a good couple of months of training since about October last year, and obviously it's paid off. You know, uh, on the back of two frustrating years, I couldn't have dreamed of this start. To be honest, I'm so happy. And, yeah, unbelievable. Obviously, Melbourne's coming up six weeks out. You've got to be happy with where the form's at now. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm still apprehensive about Melbourne. It's still uh, such a long way compared to these races, and you know I have. No experience beyond a half. Um, you know, obviously, there's going to be an amazing field there, really pushing it. And uh, you know, the bike, the distance, and, and the back end of the run, obviously, is a bit worrying. But you know, I'm as fit as I can be this time of year. And uh, you know, I'm not expecting to, to win or or you know even podium there. But I just want to put together a good race and try and learn as much as I can. You know, and, and down the track, hopefully, get a win and a nine there somewhere soon. You rise to fame, mate. You're going to be one. To, you're going to be a marked man in Melbourne. Oh, I don't know about famous, mate. It's uh, those Iron Man guys are a different level again. And uh, you know, I'm just happy where the form is. I'm happy I'm injury free. I'm happy that uh, training and racing is going well. And you know, if I have a good day there, then fantastic. But uh, you know, as I said, I'm a rookie and I've got a lot to learn at that distance. And uh, I'm just going to try and, and do my best in the day and, and see what happens. What, what is the goal? For the long term for the season, mate. Where, where, where are you looking to be at the end of the year? Uh, if I can, I'd, I'd like to qualify for Kona. Um, you know, it's quite hard. With uh, if I don't do it, if I only do uh, Melbourne, it's going to be uh, quite hard on points to make it. But um, you know, I'll do my best to try and scrape in for Kona and have a go. But obviously, Vegas is the big goal. Um, I feel as though I still I can do well there. Um, I haven't put together a good race at the the pointy end of the season, which is you know what matters this time of year. It's great to get some wins, but it's the pointy end of the season where you really want to get a win. And you know I haven't forgotten that, and I've got a long way to go until then. And you know hopefully I can put together a good day in Vegas. And just from a from a personal perspective, obviously this, these two wins have got to mean a heck of a lot for you after the last two years of pretty much oh, disappointment. Definitely, mate. It's unbelievable. I can't believe it. Um, you know, at the start of the year, I, I put together a bit of a goal to try and get a few wins, and you know, I've already got a couple. <laughs> If I can keep going and, and get one or two more over in the US, then you know I'll be so happy with my season compared to the last two. Um, it's a different level again in the US. You know, everyone comes out to play over there, and um, you know I'm, I'm under no illusion that I'm, I'm going to go over there as a favourite. There's still so many favourites over there that are going to push me hard. And you know, if I can keep training and injury free, then you know hopefully the form continues. But uh, I've got a lot of hard work ahead of me yet. Well, congratulations on today's win and uh, best of luck for Melbourne. Thank you very much.